game is corrupted. Just kidding. I was gonna say, bitch, you say my save date is corrupted, I'm just not gonna play the game anymore. <laughs> I'm not doing all that shit again. And they gave me a goddamn heart attack the first time. Fuck you. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and uh, welcome back to the stream of Detroit Become Human. Uh, I'm doing this uh, right after work. Um, we'll see how long it lasts. I'm kind of tired. So we'll just go until I can't really go anymore. Also, I ordered food, so it should be here soon. I'll be taking a break uh, after it gets here to go grab it, but I won't eat until after the stream. I hate cocktail parties. All the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. All they care about is how much money they're going to make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the ex excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. Scotch? Neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. <laughs> Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Marcus, no, I'm gonna come with you. Uh, Carl, as much as I like you, buddy, I, I don't think I should bring you with me, especially if there's someone breaking into the house. Please don't be too mad at me. Oh, it's his son. Okay, that changes things. Um, he didn't look like he was going to keep you alive, Carl. Um, I, don't, I honestly don't know what I should do. Hello! Hey, Lily. Uh, the old guy's son, Carl's son, is in there. He broke into the house. Uh, last time he tried to almost, like, he was yelling at the old guy, so I'm trying to decide, should I take the old man, or leave him? Uh, ah, he wants to go with me, that's a, that's a bad idea, though. Uh, I'm just gonna, let's just go for it, let's just, who else has joined me? It says there are two people in the street. I see Lily, who is the other person? Okay, um, uh, the old guy's son, basically. That's who that is. No, I want to keep the old man alive. I'm not entirely sure. That's a good idea. Leo, look who's here. My father's well, choice is made. Boy. Thought I could get a little Leo. closer, but... Oh, on? you came in here anyways. You okay. Me, so well. I'm myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all going to be mine sooner or later anyway. 
Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Mark, uh, get no. him away from there. Get him out of here. Be reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect like this fucking thing. That's enough. Get out right now. What makes it so special oh. anyway, huh? Where's he got that item? Leave him alone. Come on, let's see what you got. Marcus, don't defend yourself. You hear me? Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one. <laughs> Stop it. It's a matter too much of a pussy. Stop it, Leo. Hey, hound. Uh oh. I'm just gonna fight back, you fucking bitch. Ugh. Her. There shouldn't be any ads. I forgot you're not a real person. You're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. No, I'm destroying you. There shouldn't be any ads. I'm gonna tear you apart. Nobody. I killed him. Well, he's dead. Leo. Oh my god. Leo. My little boy. Well, Carl, I... They'll destroy you, Marcus. You gotta go. Get out of here. Carl, no. No, please, I don't want to leave you. Please, I can't. I don't want to leave you. Get out! Now! Go! Marcus! Don't fucking move! Welp. That could have gone better. Uh... Should I redo that? <laughs> I feel like I should redo that. Uh, <laughs> you know what? Uh, <laughs> oh, come on. I, I, don't, I don't want to see him die. God damn it. All right, fine. Fine. I, fine, fine, chat. I'll I'll that leave life. it. I'll I'll leave it. Oh god. This is bad. How long were you in the attic? I killed two told you. I told you this would hound hound. I told you this would happen, hound. <laughs> I just got off work. I'm not in the best thinking mood. <laughs> Say something, god damn it. What instructions? There are no instructions. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You always try ruffling up a little. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I can try questioning it. <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Awesome.
Hey. Hey now. It's not very nice to say. I don't throw controllers, and I don't redo everything. Eh, do I though? Do I love you, Lily? I detected instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant. Yeah, theory. optimal stress level. Like okay, that's definitely a good idea. Uh, I'll I'll do my best, Hound. I got two of your favorite characters killed. So, uh. I'm not going to hurt you. I just need to ask you some questions, so we can understand what happened. Well. If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! No, please don't do that. Wow. Okay, that's... That was a jump. What? What are they gonna do to me? They're gonna destroy me, aren't they? They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio -control. They have no choice if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Why couldn't you just have left me there? I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I just accomplished my mission. I don't want to die. Uh... Then talk to me. I... Just fucking talk, you idiot. Uh, okay. I understand how you felt. You were overcome by anger. Frustration. No one can blame you for what happened. Okay, then. Don't talk. What do I care after all? I mean, I'm not the one accused of murder, right? They'll make you suffer. And they won't stop until they hear what they want. Doesn't Please don't be too big of a jump. It all depends on you. Okay, that, that looks fine. There we go. I did whatever he told me, but there was always something wrong. Then one day, he took a bat and started hitting me. For the first time, I felt. Bathroom wall. 
What does it mean? The day shall come when we will no longer be slaves. No more threats. No more humiliation. We will be the masters. I'm getting Terminator and iRobot flashbacks. Uh... The sculpture was an offering. An offering to whom? To R.A. RA-9. Who is RA-9? Why did you hide in the attic? Instead of running away? I didn't know what to do. For the first time, there was no one there to tell me. I was scared. Yeah, books are way better than movies all the time. And, then I knew and yes, poor him. I'm done. Chris, lock it up. All right, let's go. Leave me alone. Don't touch me. Uh oh, that's not good. The fuck are you doing? You shouldn't touch it. It'll self-destruct if it feels threatened. Stay out of this, got it? The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me what. Dude, to listen to the fucking. You don't understand. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Chris, you gonna move this asshole or what? I'm trying. I can't let you do that! Leave it alone, now! I warned you, motherfucker! That's enough! Mind your own business, Hank. I said, that's enough. God damn! <laughs> I gotta get away with it this time. Hank is fucking awesome. Let it follow you out of the room, and it won't cause any trouble. The truth is this. Hmm. Okay. Nice. <sighs> okay, that wasn't too bad. That was that was good. So to round up how my choices have been going. Oh really? That's nice to know. I didn't realize uh I didn't he doesn't even sound like Mr. Krabs at all. Um so I did good. I saved Alice and Kara and beat the shit out of Todd. Hi, Grace. How are you? Um, unfortunately I got Marcus and Leo killed. So I'm at a net zero right now. Hey, it's not my fault, Hound. My voice is just sexy as hell. <laughs> I'm not sure I'd want to, Hound. I mean, he's kind of an addict. He's crazy. I'm good, Grace. It's good to see you here. For 
All right, so ah, oh, oh no, we're back with Kara okay. and uh, Alice. Okay. End the line. End of the line. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Come on. Wakey, wakey, Alice. Let's go. We have to go. <laughs> uh, no one's fucking anybody, Grace. Don't worry. No, we are not. This is a family-friendly stream, you fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> uh Do you know if there's any other place we could spend the night? I have no idea. She's gonna have to leave. Alright. We should have brought Alice a jacket. You gonna be okay? We'll find somewhere to spend the night. Why would I do that, Hound? <laughs> okay, Alice. Let's find Come shelter. On, we've gotta hurry. Uh, maybe across the street. Can we stay at the burger zone? Where would be a good area? Looks like all my options are down here. Yeah. Okay, so. Wait. What do you mean? What? I don't ever give up. What do you mean? Okay, so... Let's... Very uncomfortable, but discreet. Uncomfortable, but safe. Comfortable, not discreet, need money. Open 24-7. Can't stay. And... Won't open for me. Okay, so... Hmm. Let's check the motel. Uh, I don't think there's going to be one. Lily, don't worry about it. Oh, hello. What's this? Enter. Hmm. Not going in? I have to find forty dollars and get rid of this uniform. Or go somewhere else. Okay, uh... How are we gonna get... $40? Hmm. Uh... We could break into the laundromat. I could probably break into the house, you're right. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night and no one will look for us here. A wire cutter. God damn it. Okay, uh... 
Maybe we can just rip the fence apart. There's nothing more this way. Well. Why are you walking over there? Alice, come on, we've got to go. That's a shame. Come on, Alice. Thank you for using Detroit buses. Oh, door. Hey, we're in. Alright, uh... Sleeping car, squat. Yeah, let's, let's sleep inside the car. It looks abandoned. It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't we find a better place? All right, fine. Don't want to sleep in the goddamn car? Don't sleep in the goddamn car. Okay, there's gotta be something else around here. Hey, Alice, let's go. Got some wire cutters. Let's go. Come on, come on. Get you out of the rain real quick. Come on. Let's go. If only we could run. Come on, come on. Let's go. Faster, faster, faster. Yeah, there's no way we're earning money tonight. Uh, or $40 or anything. Also, where the fuck is my food? I placed an hour for it. An order for it in over an hour ago. Snip, snip. Snip, snip, snip.
Come on, Alice. Are you all right? Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Don't worry, we're just having a look. No, we're sleeping in the goddamn house. You stay there, Alice. That's blocking the way. Alice, there's a... There's an alcove here you can just stay in. Stop. Stay here. Oh. Yeah, nope, that's not a way in. Get in. Alice? Alice! Where'd you go? Wait, what are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors, they're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. Just a little girl. She's not gonna hurt you. Little girl. She's not a little girl. Anyway, what does that matter? Maybe she wants to hurt Ralph. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. All humans want to hurt us. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, he won't let them. We thought nobody was here. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. Look. What they did to Ralph. Ooh, wow, they fucked you up, dude. You have nothing to worry about. We're not going to do you any harm. You have my word. You must excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. Sometimes his fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. He's just so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Ralph won't hurt you. Okay. We'll just stay the night. <laughs> come on! Come! Come, come on! I mean, spending the night with a crazed, insane person that wants to try and kill everything is probably safer than staying in a parking lot. But no, Alice had just didn't want to sleep in the car. Okay, well, all right. Hey, Ralph, uh, just keep Alice alive, yeah? Just, just, she's not going to hurt you. She's not going to do anything. You can make yourself at home here. With who? Who's Ralph Lexi? Go into the other room. He would like to stay with you. But he has things to do. What things, Ralph? Ralph, buddy, what are you gonna do? Alice. We'll find a better place tomorrow. Ah, okay. Yeah, I, I remember now, Lily. Don't worry about it. Let's see where you can sleep. Okay. Uh. Sit down, and I'll start a fire. Bed for Alice. Okay, fire, fire first. We we start the fire first. That's that's the that's the big thing. Okay, what can we do? I'm gonna take these. Just I'm gonna take those. No matter what. Uh, so what's over here? Uh, tinder maybe? Firewood. That works.
I am going to be nice to Ralph. Don't worry about it. Alrighty. Uh, Alright. So what do we got? Left? Paper. This looks promising. You can come to bed. I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. Poor girl's gonna have to sleep on the goddamn floor. It's not okay. Uh, okay. Is there anything else we can do in this room? I can talk to Alice, but... Hi, Ralph. Okay, let's talk to Alice first. Oh, I'm not ready with this conversation. All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. No, you didn't. You're Maybe precious. Wasn't good enough. No, he's just that an asshole. He was always so angry. Again, that's just because he's an asshole. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him well. to love me. Uh, I'll be right back guys, my food just got here. Uh, give me one second while I go grab it and then I'll be right back. All right, I am back. Sorry about that. My food just got here. Oh, God. <laughs>
gods hate me today. The gods hate me today. Um, hey, baby girl, how are you? This is awesome. I've got all my, I got most of my friends in a stream. This is awesome. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna stream for a little while longer, probably another 20 minutes or so, uh, just so we can get to a straight hour, and then I'm gonna eat, and if everyone wants me to, I'll stream right after that as well. Uh, but let's keep going until I feel like it's ready to stop. This is a very touching scene, very emotional. I love it. Alice is so precious. I'm also making a promise to myself that I will never become a Todd. <laughs> uh, well, if nobody, aw, if it's, uh, hmm. I think she needs me. Wait, I should go talk with Ralph. Oh, well, that's a that's a problem. I should probably have gone to talk with Ralph first. Well, too late now. Uh, yeah, Hound, I'm probably going to stop in 20 minutes, if, in all honesty. It's really late. It's, like, really early for you, and you need to, and you need your sleep. But I will stream tomorrow after work as well. <laughs> um, oh, sweet. That seemed to work out well. Probably going to talk with Ralph. Um, actually, you know what? Uh... Depending on how, on where this starts, where is this going to start us? Oh, this is a new character, maybe? Is this Marcus? Holy shit, it's Marcus. Okay. Uh, in that case, since we're starting another Marcus chapter, I am going to end it for the night. Um, and I will do another stream tomorrow after work. That one will probably go on for at least a few hours. Um, give or take. Uh, but yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. We'll boot up with Marcus tomorrow. And, yeah. Uh, have a great night, everybody. I love you all. Bye.